has caught his eye. But it's got two problems, an alarm system and a hefty security guard. But he won't let that stand in his way. This is the false alarm. For what Alex has in mind, he needs an accomplice. And after hanging around for 20 minutes, he spots these two guys. They enter the shop. If all goes to plan, unbeknown to them, these two unsuspecting shoppers will soon become Alex's partners in crime. He follows them into the shop. He appears to be browsing, but in reality, he's more interested in the marks. He needs to be sure that they'll stay long enough for him to carry out his plan. He picks up a pair of socks. He's not going to steal them, but those socks still have an important role to play in the scam. Result. The marks head for the changing room. They'll be there for a few minutes, which is all the time Alex needs to get to work. With the security guard on duty, he'll need to be quick. It's not, it's not me. It's too prep boy, not DJ look. While the marks are busy looking good... I like to be back here. I like to be back here. Alex is busy picking up some expensive threads. Hello. All right, no, not for dancing. Don't work. And stuffing them straight in his bag. His bag is now full of goods worth nearly £200. But he can't walk straight out as all the items are tagged and he'll set off the alarm. This is where the marks come in. Now they're at the changing room, Alex sees his chance. The security guard is only metres away, so he can't make any mistakes. Sorry, sorry. Let's take a look at that again. Alex brushed past the mark, dropping the tagged socks into the open bag. The fact that the mark has an open bag is no coincidence. This is exactly what Alex was on the lookout for. So now when the mark leaves with the tagged socks in his bag, he'll trigger the alarm, giving Alex a five-second window to escape with his stolen goods. Now, all Alex has to do is walk out directly behind the mark, who is about to make a purchase. OK. Honestly, try them shops and see if you have any luck in there, yeah? Okay. Them two shops, all right? No worries. All right. Thanks so much. Cheers. Disaster. Without warning, the marks change their mind and walk out, leaving Alex trapped inside the shop with a bag full of tagged goods. What's he going to do? That's it, he's off. So what just happened? The socks in the Mark's bag triggered the alarm, so thinking on his feet, Alex positioned himself by the exit. <laughs> 